Hello Crystals, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we are gonna talk about isotonic and the isometric contraction. So without wasting so much time, let's get started. So the first is isotonic contraction. In the isotonic contraction, the word iso stands for the same and the tonic means the tone. So the meaning of isotonic contraction is that the tone is remains same during the contraction of the muscle only the length of the muscle changes according to the length changes the isotonic contraction is divided into the two parts which are the uh, concentric contraction and the eccentric contraction the meaning of concentric contraction is that length of the muscle decreases during the contraction and du uh, during the eccentric contraction length of the muscle increases. I will give you some examples so you can easily understand what is concentric contraction and what is eccentric contraction. So during the uh, movement of elbow flexion there is a concentric contraction of the biceps muscle and eccentric contraction of the triceps muscle because during the elbow flexion the biceps is contracting so the length of the biceps decreases and the triceps is lengthens so uh, we can say that uh, there is a eccentric contraction of the triceps muscle I hope it makes sense to you and uh, you understand what I am try to tell you uh, the next is isometric contraction so the word iso stands for the same and the metric means the length so the meaning of isometric contraction is that length of the muscle remains same during the contraction only tone of the muscle changes uh, so uh, during uh, we push some object right so uh, when we push a heavy object our muscle length remain as it is but we use our power of the muscle tone to push that object I hope uh, you understand this topic and your concept is now clear so the thank you all bye